Hey guys, how you doing right here again? If you'd like to subscribe, it's Nitro Kyosho. Today, we're off the beaten path. We're down here in Monroe, Connecticut, Stepney Cemetery. This is for anybody that's a fan of the Conjuring movies, the Nun movies. There's another Nun movie coming another month. I think another Conjuring next year. If you're a fan of the Annabelles, we're going today to visit the grave site of the two famous people. Everything is based on Ed and Lorraine Warren. I'm going to take a little shot of that so they can see that. And then we are going to pause the video. We're going to walk through the cemetery and look for the grave. And when we get near it, we'll restart it because I don't think you want to see the entire cemetery filmed. Okay, guys, we're approaching it. It's right over here. I'm a little down here. This is a real old cemetery, guys. As you saw from the sign there, a lot of people from different wars buried here. And here it is. From this Edward Warren, U.S. Navy, World War II. Wow, he was in World War II just like my father. All right, here's the stone. Get a nice film of that. Edward Warren Miney, born September 7, 1926, died August 23, 2006. His beloved wife, Lorraine Warren, born January 31. Boy, this is a beautiful stone. Sunday, Monday, and always. Somebody covered up with Raggedy Ann dolls here. Their hearts were full of spring. There's some nice flowers there. You can see people have left little things here for them. But that's an absolute, some beads up there. Somebody left a little thing up there that says Seeking Ghosts with A and L. There's some little stuff over here, some little skulls and stuff people put there. The Mighty American Flag. For a veteran. Again, people put the Annabelle, the dolls there. That was what it really was, was a Raggedy Ann doll. And a nice bench here. I'm not sure what this. S B and D D over on this side, but and I don't think these ones on the side were any, any relatives of them. But an absolutely beautiful, uh, beautiful memorial, guys. This is interesting. What it says here: Sunday, Monday, always. It's uh, absolutely beautiful. We wanted to come down and meet uh, Lorraine, and unfortunately, COVID got in the way of that. And then during that, she passed away, not of COVID, of old age. But unfortunately, we never got to, uh, to meet her. There's another memorial on the side here too. On both looks like on both sides. Oh, that's beautiful. Let's see if you can get a good shot of that. St. Michael, Archangel. Let me see if I can read what that says. Defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him. We humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the divine power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who roam throughout the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Wait a minute, there's more over here. Film that side. I don't know who that. Film down here. This says, uh, 
the New England Society for Psychic Research, founded 1952 by Ed and Lorraine Warren. This is absolutely beautiful, what they did here. Very, very nice. Yeah. So, I hope you guys like this video. This is for anybody who's into the movies. And uh, there's our famous Annabelle down here. I'm not going to touch anybody's stuff that they put here. But uh, there you go, guys. I hope you like this video. And after we leave here, we're going to check out the uh, Union Cemetery, which was featured in one of the movies, I believe. It's supposed to be one of the most haunted cemeteries in the country. So there you go. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Thanks for watching, guys. Hey guys, how you doing? Right here again. If you'd like to subscribe, it's Nitro Kyosho. We just left the uh, Warren's grave. And now we came to the house here. As you can see, the museum is closed. At least take notice. Violators will be prosecuted. But come back to me if you're going to get over here. Good show. And you can hold my head in the rain warm. Right there. into there. I'm not sure if the daughter still lives here with uh, her husband Tony Spiro. Uh, uh, looks like somebody could live there. The house is in nice shape. But anyways, we don't want to hang out here too long because uh, I think the neighbors like to call the police. People are hanging out here too long. But that is the famous home and that cellar there is from the movie, that's where uh, Annabelle was kept in the cellar for Warren's home. Pretty cool looking house, the design of it and everything. But, uh, we're not going to go on the property, we don't want no trouble with the police, and we don't want to disrespect the family. But, uh, there it is, there's a sign here too, it's a private property. The property is under 24 hour video surveillance because. I know, I think it was Lorraine said, or Ed, I think it was Lorraine that said it, that somebody had offered like $2 million to buy the Annabelle down. So, if it is in there, which could be, uh, obviously it's under heavy surveillance, you see there's cameras everywhere and everything, so uh, probably is still in the house, the museum is probably still intact, so... Unfortunately, it is closed, and uh, I know the husband's name. I don't know if we could get in touch with him. Uh, we can certainly try, but I'm certainly not going to go on the property trying to ring the doorbell or anything like that. But there it is. It looks like their driveway was down over here. It's actually a beautiful area. They have a nice, beautiful wooded, nice wooded area here. But, uh, when you come up here, you can film a little bit this way. I'm up on the hill here, so you can film to the south here. Definitely a, a weird kind of shaped house. I've never seen a house like this the way it's built. It's like almost a colonial, like the half of the roof. Come up over here and film this quick and then get out of here before we bring in the police here. It's pretty cool though. Definitely a... But yeah, I see lamps in the window and stuff, so... Somebody probably is still... I'm sure somebody is living there. But unfortunately, I'm not going to go banging on anybody's door because I don't want any trouble. Alright guys, that's about it for today. Thanks for watching.